everyone, Leal Ganet Kwanzoy, Grade 8 from Santolan High School, and welcome to Saiyan Sikula! The human body is composed of many or trillion of cells. What are cells? All forms of life are made up of cells and it was further studied by several biologists that is very small and cannot be seen by the naked eye. A microscope was invented by Anton van Leeuwenhoek, a Dutch biologist to see the details of the cell. The microscope has developed different varieties for specific use in the study of the cell. The cell membrane, nucleus, and cytoplasm are the three major parts of the typical cell. That is now understood one time. The cell membrane controls and regulates the entry and exit of materials of the cell. The nucleus controls all the activities of the cell. Cytoplasm provides all the function of cell for cell expansion, growth, and replication. It is where chemical reactions take place, which includes the production, packaging, and warehouse development. New cells are formed through cell division. It is one of the significant events that was discovered by Rudolf Virchow, a German pathologist in 1858. The cell divides and becomes two. Thus, the two daughter cells forming the process of cell division and a series of events that takes place in a cell as it grows and divides in the cell cycle. Most of the time, a cell spends the longest period in the interface. During this time, it grows, replicates its chromosomes, and prepares for the next stage for cell division. The interface includes three major events that the cell is taking place. First growth, or G1 is where the cell growth and normal metabolic functions prior to DNA duplication. During G1 phases, also called the first gap phase, the cell grows physically larger, copies organelles, and makes the molecular building blocks that will need in later steps. Second, synthesis or S phase, where DNA replication is happening. At S phase, the cell synthesizes a complete copy of the DNA in its nucleus. It also duplicates a microtubule, organizing structure called centrosome. The centrosome helps separate DNA during N phase. Lastly, second growth are G2, where growth and preparation for mitosis after DNA replication, and it also the subphase that separates interphase from mitotic or N phase. During the gap phase, the cells grow more, make proteins and organelles and begins to reorganize its content in preparation for mitosis. G2 phase ends when mitosis begins. And that's all for today. See you in the next science. Signal